watch Randolph. I bought the entire Mr. Beast burger menu. Mark Bank. He should be interesting enough. Mr. Beast Burger, can you believe it? Another YouTuber has another restaurant on Deliveroo <laughs> and Uber Eats and all that jazz. And today, I'm trying it. I tried the size one, the side men restaurant. That was very, yeah. very good. Really enjoyed it. Now it's time to try someone who's not from the UK, who's from overseas. They have made food if you've got that. Right now, Big Ben, Mother Night, Queen. As you guys know, I'm gonna try some food and I'm gonna talk to you guys while I try it. So without any further ado, let's go. All right, so pretty simple. We're gonna, gonna take this food and we're gonna eat it. And I'll give you my opinion on it. We have in this box right here, as you can see, very nice packaging. Let's first talk about that. Looks good, but yellow, you've got blue, you've got red. There's three primary colors. If you mix yellow and red and purple together, and blue, you get orange. Right, these are Do you? the fries. I, now, I have to admit, it took that. John a while to set the cameras up. I might have blue. been one of these fries already. So I've had, I have, well, I'm just going to be honest, I've eaten them already. But, it's good. That's a play. We've got some loaded fries as well, for try those too. I think that, hold on, these need the old ketchup. Let's try that. But to be fair, every cheese yeah. ketchup, doesn't it? Or some sort of dip, so I'm not going to rate it harshly. On needing ketchup. I think we should do the loaded fries next. Well, you know what? Oh, I'm going to open the box. Where is the ketchup? What's more, I'm going to everything on the menu. Everything apart from 7 Up. Or Diet Pepper. I've tried that before. I don't even like it. So, what do we have here? We have, ooh, this looks to be a chicken sandwich, okay? So, in the UK, we call chicken sandwiches chicken, chicken, chicken burger. I know it's not a chicken burger, but if you're from the America, from the United States, just know that we call it chicken burger, okay? So, I'm having a chicken what? burger here. Now, this is chicken two. sandwich. He does. Nashville hot and it's going burger. Burger. It's just regular burger. chicken burger. Yeah. So I'm not sure which one this is. Let's try. Let's go for it. How the sandwich if it's got stuff that's literally called burger? Uh -huh. <laughs> Sometimes you've got to get dirty to have fun. That's what my dad always told me. Is growing up. If that's not the hot one, then that's me, man. <clears throat> this is quite similar to the side sando in the sense that it's got two tendons in it rather than like a, a patty of chicken. Do you have patties of chicken? I don't know. Never watched one as well. I wouldn't know. You know what I'm saying? It's got two in. So what we could do in the future, we could try to put the side men sides versus Mr. Beast Burger. If you'd like to see what? that, leave a like on the video. We'll do a blind taste test or something like that. Leave a oh, like. If you can get to 20,000 likes on this video, I'll do a blind taste test with the sides and Mr. Beast Burger. I'm not going to give that video like? yet. I'm wondering if these sides, the sando, but in that video, a future video, if we get the likes, I'll do it. Okay. That was nice. Very hot. But nice, okay? Let's take from this side now. Also, Happy New Year to everyone. Hopefully you're all having a good New Year. Good 2020. Yeah, halfway too. through January, fucking hell. Yeah. That is all. Hopefully a good Christmas it's as well. Hopefully what, the celebrations were good. Uh, if you didn't manage to celebrate that's, Christmas, that's you're probably COVID now. It's Sorry, fucking close enough. Good now. And whoa! Look at this one. Boy, that has got beef, bacon and chips inside of it. And cheese, obviously. It, I think this might be the Mr. Beef special, you know. Like, yeah. That hot burger really has <laughs> messed me up. Look at this, man. This is, this is top, top. Burgerage. Great burgerage here. We're gonna go for it, okay? Burgerage. Wow. You know what? I like, I like the fact that chips are in the burger. I know you can always just add chips yourself. It's like a hash brown. You put hash brown in the burger. I mean, I guess it could probably taste good, because... I mean, you eat the burger, then you eat the burger. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Let's try it. 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 let Seven out of ten. This try I mean, yeah, could be fine. I can't really have so many other things to try. Now, anything else over seven? Well, that's pretty evident how nice I was to you. Would you like some food again? Yeah, some chips. Six out of ten chips. What okay, a gracious man! He offers the chips to the camera. Man, <laughs> who's having to film in me, David? Well, that, could, that could be the regular chicken sandwich, you know. So if that's not the hot one, then oof, what's next? So let's go for this thing right here. What's this one? Right, we have in door number three. Or four, or five, we have. This just looks like a cheeseburger. So this could be Chandler style or Chris style. My phone was working. Oh, so the one with chips in that I just tried a minute ago, that was Chris style. So, Chris, no. round of applause to you. That was a top, top burger. This one here is a. He doesn't so right awkward. Here. So, I'm gonna eat Mr. Beast's meat. Let's go. Ooh. That to me tastes more like I'm, an American style I burger. I did notice that scenting. Well. That's a bit weird. Yeah. yeah, that's definitely the American feel you get. When you expect to go to America with American style burger, you know. I would say it's like Five Guys, Shane Shack style still, but that's that. You know, you know what I mean? You just taste in America. Yeah, that's what I'm tasting right here. America. Right. Mr. V style? Fuck that, it's a fan. 8 out of 10. Uh, Chris's are still the best. Chris is absolutely off the chain. You know what? I'm finally over that's the hot burger. The hot chicken burger. <laughs> Having that at the start was not a good idea, but I, I didn't know. I thought it was a regular one. It didn't, it didn't look hot. You know, national hot, I'm expecting it to be red, saucy, but it was, it was not that. Right. I've got a confession to me. Mr. Beast, when he first started his Team Seeds, messaged me on Twitter about donating or getting involved. At the time, I don't know what I was doing, but I kind of just saw it and didn't reply. 
he goes to Mr. Beast. And now I've seen that they've actually reached the goal, TCs, and I feel really, really bad. Not that I ignore what? him, I feel more bad for not taking part in the, you know, the promotion. Surely it would... So I'm, I'm gonna donate, right, I'm gonna donate, I'll donate a thousand pounds to Team Seas, just as a, Surely you know, well, wouldn't feel bad, bad because they the the If they didn't the complete the challenge, the then you probably you should yeah, feel yeah. bad. John, John Keen, the pool one. So for that reason, I'm gonna donate a fair. Right. What's next? Oh my how, god. How do you go from that to food? Whoa. These must be the loaded fries, okay? The one thing I've learned is you guys commented saying, why don't you use a lid to scoop the chips up? So I'm gonna do that. Use a what? That's that's the speed to get out the sea right there. But you know what? I'm gonna use this right here. Use the lid. I'm not gonna lie. This looks. Oh wait. This oh, it's nice, a remote. But it might be nice. I it's think. One of the things where you know the taste is more important than the visuals. You know. So let's see what I can do here. Got the sound that's coming. Okay, why? Why would you not you just use your fingers? Right, I've got I've got some chips there. I've got some cheese there. It's not gonna be With a lower end fries, at least it makes a bit more sense because there's actual cheese and shit on it. Random flavors, but bit of like a it's still crazy al a bit currently algamation of algorithms in there. But it's not bad. This chip's got all kind of things on it. Let's try that one. It's good, good. It's not my favorite chip nice. in the world, I have to be honest. But good. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this as well. If you want to see more Randy tries food, let me know. Randy love Ben. I think it's very nice that like, inside men and Mr. Beast Burger, it's very YouTube related. Yes. I know I was very late with Mr. Beast, but. You guys enjoyed the last video, but why not do another one? We've got a beautiful studio, we've got a beautiful John filming as well. So what, what more can you look? Right, next up, I'm really excited. Here we go, right, here we go. This is Carl's Deluxe, is it? I believe. Oh, this yeah. is Carl's Upside Down Burger. And I've been really excited the to try this because it's so stupid. Like, it's just stupid. This is just an Upside Down Burger. Does that make a difference to the taste? Surely they were. It's not worse, really. Right? If, if someone was going to make a sandwich like this, it what, just what, what, what a sandwich. Say, McDonald's create the perfect hamburger, right, or cheeseburger. They didn't do it like this. So let's just, you know, let me just show up and try it. It will only probably feel weird because you have never eaten anything with upside. Like I'm not a euphemism. Secondly, it feels weird in the taste. It tastes like a normal burger. It doesn't affect the taste that much, but it feels because you're touching it inside, right? You know if you, you, know if you yeah. drop like I'm not sure if you did this when you were kids. Did you put butter on your rich cheese? I, I did. Did you put butter? You drop like I'm not sure if you did this when you were kids. Did you put butter on your rich cheese? I, I did. Put butter on the rich tea, you drop it right, or toast. Everyone has toast, that's uh -huh. better. Duh. Right, if you drop it, it always lands butter side down, right? You're like, oh, uh -huh. right, it's not oh, okay. it. This feels like it's been dropped, it's fell around me around. That's what it feels like. It doesn't feel natural, but it tastes as normal. Well, yeah, it is still the same ingredient. Mm -hmm. You know what? It's a good burger. Anyway. They, they all have that American style one. You know, it's like medium rare, patty, cheese galore. But it's not my favourite. It being upside down doesn't change the taste in my opinion at all. So I feel like it's more interesting to buy. I fucking hope not. I think it won't definitely win because there's more burger at this point. At the end of the day, it's quite a normal burger. But this doesn't ate for me as well. 8 out of 10. We've got a cookie here as well. So we'll have that last. So we'll get a time to be worse than like 7. It's the wrapper. If we get to the end of the video. Or if we have a section. I don't know. It just looks like a regular cookie. Right, what's this one? Next one, next burger incoming. This is a the camera style. Two smash beef patties have seasoned and served plain with American cheese. Yeah, this looks like the quintessential. That's what that means. This just looks like a regular good That's solid. The burger. definition of a cheeseburger. That's right now. Big grand you know. Big grand mm. Thumbs up. Approve. This is very good. This is what I would expect. You know what I'm saying? This is this Essential. We use the word again because it sounds really long. Awesome. American burger. This is this is like this is yeah, he is using that word. This is like, up there with the American Shake Shack of the world. It hasn't got that Shake Shack like secret recipe that you know they would have, but in terms no, of yeah. a very solid burger, this is definitely it. You know what I mean? These videos are just a way for me to say to Laura, look, Laura, I had to do it for a video. <laughs> I had to get all this food, you know. <laughs> this is for content, right? This is Carl. This is Carl again. Carl's been doing the unthinkable what is this again. Kind of it took me a while to get that out there, but it's fine. Oh, it's, it's just an upside down again, upside man. Down. This time, it's no patty. It's Wait. just grilled cheese. This is what a grilled cheese is. No, it's right. just a grilled cheese. cheese sandwich. Sandwich. I always thought it was like a toasty. Only one's inverted, not both of them. Is that what? supposed to happen? Let me know in the comments, guys. Is it supposed to both be inverted or just one? Because I've only got one here, but. But. Well, I'm doing this now. I'll, I'll tell you what it tastes like. It, it just looks like. It just, I one of them gets just got cheese, lazy man. and decided to fucking give one set up. You don't want the meat in the beef patty. This is great. However, just stick, stick some beef in there, <coughs> like I did with your mum last night. No, <laughs> not a fan of this one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this a five. Okay, it's not bad. It's just like 
And it is just cheese. Right. That's the first imaginary And season. upside down bread. Absolutely honest. What's the last one? Probably have two more to go. We have yeah. returned with the chicken sandwich. <laughs> this is the non hot chicken sandwich. I'm gonna call it chicken burger. Screw you, Americans, man. Chicken burger is what it is, okay? If you don't know, now you know. I prefer <coughs> often a, a chicken burger like this than a cheeseburger. The Sando, I would massive fan of the Sando. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. So let's try this non hot style, okay? So, oh, oh, hot. That's good. There's something really nice about lettuce. In question, a, that's in a soul, which is a question in a I'm asking myself. Yeah. Is it better than the Sidemen Sando? <laughs> Miss Beast versus the Sidemen, two of the biggest YouTube entities in the entire world. Well, a combined that's question. What, what, like. 90... I'm not doing it. Like, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not If we get that goal, I'll do the video next time where we do Sidemen versus Mr. Beast Burger. We'll find out what's the all. Do I know the answer yet? Yes. Yeah. I'm telling you. No. Mr. Beast? That's a smart clip. Four. Made of man. Carl? Chandler, Chris, and then new Kardashian. They all start with K. Not chaos. K and C, yeah, but just In a world where Mr. Beast Burger and Side exist, Kitchen. the question is, would I order these from home? You know, not in a video setting, would I order these for a meal in front of the TV with Laura? He's not got yeah, a TV, he's got a fucking yeah, TV. I'll do that, so shout out to both of you for that. Which would I say is my favourite? This one, them. this is my favourite. This is, I think this is, Chan no, this is, yeah. No, Chris, this is Chris with the chips. Chris oh, yeah. with fries. Thanks for putting fries in burger, mate. Mm. You know what? Go and lend my stuff. This one's amazing. I'm sat home thinking, you know what? Tonight is a night of delivery. Which I'm sure it's probably every night. <laughs> 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 Just me? But now. If I was really hungry, I'd order this. If I wasn't too hungry and I wanted a burger, I would go for channel style. Just a regular, very, very good regular no. though. So, burger, burger. This one. A basic with burger. First test with a cookie. Is it always a hard cookie or is it a soft cookie? And I'll present to you. Ooh, a bit of both. Soft with hard. Why? Cool. Team soft with hard. I feel like it's just a cookie, but does that make sense? Like, no offense Show to you. Show me what I mean. I feel like I've been in this menu, they just ordered this in from somewhere, do you know what I mean? Like, these have all been yeah, theorized. Chris Handler, Mr. Beast himself, Jimmy, they've sat in a lab together. I imagine it's, a, it's a probably a laboratory, let's be honest. And they've gone, what can we do with this? What can we put in these burgers? The cookie's just a cookie in it. Yeah. But no, oh, this yeah. has been amazing. I'll give, I don't want to give it a score out of 10 in, in, overall. It's a very, very good restaurant, very, very good service. I would definitely order this as I said before. If I was at home, so, like I said, with the side then, I would just eat it. Casually, not because they're you know, YouTube people. I would eat it. Wait, I would eat it. But yeah, no, it's very, very good. Love this. I'm going to definitely going to eat some more off camera. When you guys don't judge me, stop. You at the back. Top to me. But yeah guys, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Let me know what else you want to see from Big Randy. Um and maybe in ten years I can do it with my kid as well. So kid for little Randy. He needs that on your kid. Bye! <laughs> well, another video done and reacted to.